Hey guys, it's Renee. So in my channel, I have this tips kind of DIY kind of thing on how to untangle a necklace fast. It's one of my most viewed tips kind of thing. But in this case, I wanted to show you how to untangle multiple necklaces. In this case, after I traveled. So I went home and when I was unpacking, I well discovered that all of my necklaces are tangled. And this is pretty much what I'm working with. It's like a real mess. Yeah, I just want to show you guys because this may happen to someone out there. And this is just including all kinds of necklaces. I have like a, a couple of like layered necklaces that I made myself. And they're basically like two to three necklaces in one. So this won't be a matter of knots for the most part. I didn't find any knot in here. Like the one that I share how to untangle on like the DIY that I just mentioned. Mostly this is about like the chains rolling up with the necklace chain that they have next to them somehow they found space to roll up with the next chain that they have in there or just like sometimes multiple chains i don't know how this happens because there is like no space in between them like how can a chain find its way through like other like chains if there is no space i have no idea it's a mystery to me and always will be but it's a matter of like working with one necklace at a time not trying to fix the whole thing at once because that's gonna be like stressful and sometimes it helps to just open the clasp and just find that one necklace that you're trying to remove from there even if when you packed your necklace and you packed it like closed you know what i mean but opening clasps sometimes when it's like too tangled in there helps I do have a hack kind of thing that is how to travel with jewelry without a case and honestly I should uh, practice what I preach because when I shared that hack I traveled and and my necklaces landed just fine it wasn't like this at all it was perfect but this happened to me this time because I was pretty much lazy there's no other way around it but I honestly shouldn't be because I feel like this damages the necklaces a lot when they are like all tangled granted I mostly have like custom jewelry so none of this is like real gold Old, you know what I mean? But I like them anyways. I want to still wear them. Also, this is a bit longer. Um, it's not like super long, but it's longer than my usual like time that I like of content. And that is because I tried to make this short and sweet by fast forwarding the whole thing, but it didn't make sense at all. You couldn't even see what I was doing. So I just decided to leave the whole thing in. Hopefully it's not too boring, but I'm going to stop tacking now so you can see what I'm doing.
but hopefully if you have this problem watching what I did here and how I separated all the necklaces give you an idea or two on how to remove each necklace and how you can remove them without damaging your necklaces I'm just showing you that none of them broke but yeah, hopefully this was helpful and handy and you liked it. And if you did, don't forget to give this a thumbs up. Check out the other DIYs that I mentioned and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you later and take care. Bye.